Welcome back to The Sauce. We're live from our 7th Avenue studios right now. I'm with Kelly Rowland, and you're getting bombarded with IMs from your fans. But I don't mind. I'm yeah, no, a little but they love well. you. <laughs> now, I know you said, uh, Miss Kelly, it's it's more of a personal side. We're going to see different sides of you. Mm -hmm. So this is kind of a personal question. I know you've had some high-profile relationships. Is it hard to maintain your privacy when, you know, you're with another celebrity and you're huge, too? It it is um, a little difficult to, to have that privacy, but I know for me, I made the decision to announce it. Of course, I, I thought I was going to get married, <laughs> but I didn't. Um, but, I mean, things happen, and I'm still very happy for Roy, and he's still a great guy. And I think everything happens for a reason, and um, I wish him the best. But I know my, um, hopefully, next relationship, mm -hmm. Um, I won't talk about anything. You won't talk about anything? I don't anything. think anybody will know anything about relationships or anything on me until I'm married. They'll just see a ring on my hand and like, yeah, I did it. <laughs> You're just going to go off somewhere and have a private ceremony, oh, something definitely. like that? Definitely. I think that that's, I, I, well, of course, I had to go through the experience to, to know, but um, I feel like that's personal now. Mm -hmm. I feel like you have to keep some things just private because you never know what can happen. Yeah, and you live and you learn, and now yes, you know, and exactly. then for the future, you're kind of set. Exactly. Uh, so there's been a lot of buzz about the song, I'm Still in Love with My Ex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is, is that all you care to say? Yeah. Yeah. Is it Do you is know the what? message in the song? The song will tell the story. You have to get Miss Kelly to hear the whole, the whole song. That's the song that I'm actually most vulnerable on, on the whole record. Um, that one and maybe like three others. Um, but that one was a really vulnerable song for me and it was actually really good for me as well because it was really therapeutic I felt like a lot of people prob possibly felt the way I did you know so you know when you hear my thoughts and you hear my expression and sometimes the way I'm even hitting some notes like I remember mm -hmm. I was crying on this part where I said said that I loved you and I remember my, my play brother his name is Lonnie Burrell big shout out to him he was like sis you all right I was like yes let me finish <laughs> yeah because that is you want that you're emotion. releasing you want that emotion on the song you know yeah so, it was good. It was therapeutic. Well, on this album, you have a lot of collaborations with Eve, with Snoop. Mm -hmm. There's so many talented people out there. I'm sure so many people want to work with you. How do you decide who you're going to bring on your album? I've loved Eve since, uh, gosh, since the very first record she put out. Um, and also Destiny's Child um, got a chance to go on tour with her. And I remember her show was so entertaining every night and she's such a great artist and a great person as well i was so happy when she came through for me for like this and because it's such a uh, an amazing record and i wanted her to be on that record with Absolutely. me because she i just felt her energy on that song even before she did it so when she said yes i was so happy and snoop um i love snoop's this doggy <laughs> style that's always been my record i remember getting in trouble and buying that album over and over again as a kid because i wasn't supposed to have and it. you just wanted to listen to and it and i had to do a collabo with snoop i've always been a fan of his and i'm so happy that he came through for me as well okay and tank as well he wrote two songs and produced two songs off the record and we did do that together so you're working with everybody yes it was a blessing very cool <laughs> okay so miss kelly's in stores june 26th mm -hmm. and right now we're going to take a look at you and eve All with right. like this so All let's right. check out the video ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. I told y'all I was going to walk 